I do apologize, Mr. Sagat, but no tigers are allowed. All right, people, it is your friend Raza's Retro, and we're going to get straight into it. No tigers, Street Fighter 2 challenge. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, well. <sighs> I mean, did it really have to be him? I don't know, the worst part is, is that I'm playing it on the keyboard. Oh god. But you know what? He's the first character. Maybe it won't be so bad. Um, as I play, I do want to give some shoutouts. I'll try my best to focus and give the shoutouts. But big, big shoutouts to everyone who has taken part so far. If I do miss a name, I do apologize in advance. Retro Projection. I believe he was the first entry. John Bundy. Galloway Gaming. Raichu Reeves. Subliminal VCR with that crazy, crazy score and gameplay. I mean, he, he almost beat the game. Crazy to think about that. Uh, for the, those who haven't seen that run, you, you have to. It was amazing. Um, Mike Tendo Power, Raichu Reeves. I think I might have just mentioned his name. If I did, well, that's a double mention. <laughs> uh, Galloway Gaming. And of course, Mark Goes Blind Gaming. Oh my god. His entry was so funny. And you know what I love about him? Is like... Any video this guy posts out, he takes a lot of time, he puts a lot of effort into it, you know, he edits it, he tries to make it funny, he tries to make it unique. I mean, a lot of love and respect for that. Um, at the same time, Mike Tendo Power for taking part. I believe he took part in two challenges and was away for a bit. It was nice to see him take part here. Um, also, big shout out to PG Venom, always, you know, for showing the love and support. Crash Bandito, and God, what was that? Um, yeah, and just anybody. I mean, anybody that has been showing love and support, man. It is really, really appreciated. Um, but I will try to focus now. Because this, this is actually a really hard challenge. And uh, what I've noticed is most of the people that took part were either able to beat, like, one character, maybe two. I think in some cases even three but after that it's like i think the only one like i believe retro projection if memory serves me correct had four and obviously subliminal vcr had that crazy score of like 10 wins um so yeah it's it's quite difficult and it makes it harder because you can't do segots iconic tiger uppercut tiger fireball tiger knee oh man what I would kill to do a tiger knee or a tiger uppercut or a tiger fireball but I can't it's not allowed it's not allowed I mean I'm just playing this now and this is actually frustrating <laughs> I can imagine how everyone else felt uh, that took part oh man I'm like really worried, I don't know what to do, should I, oh, should I keep my distance? Oh my god, well, there you have it people, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do a second or third or fourth run, um, okay, I'll tell you what, I'll do an additional try. Just to see what I could do. Um, if I could do something great, if not, then no problem. But I'll give it an additional try. Why not? Can't be going out with just one win, but I think that's probably what it's going to be. Oh, and I forgot to give a big shout out. I am so sorry to Papa Bear Gaming. Uh, what a lovely dude he is as well. He always has fun. With his videos, his challenges, great sense of humor, great guy, great content creator. So big shout out to him as well. Um, and yeah, I've had a lot of fun watching everyone take part, trying to do their thing, you know. Um, it's always great to see. And yeah, I'm going to try to use a different strategy. I'm kind of scared to like do too many buttons because I'm using a keyboard. I don't want to end up throwing like a tiger uppercut or a tiger fireball. 
Sometimes that can happen, obviously, by mistake. That's kind of been my fear. Yeah. Too sure what strategy I'll be going with there. Uh, don't ask. I think maybe the best strategy for me will be just kind of like what, what I stuck with, which was the jump, high jump, low kick combo type of, uh, type of thing. <laughs> I think this run is going to be even worse. Oh my god, this is frustrating. I apologize for putting you people through this. I kind of know how you guys feel now. This is bloody hard. And it's not even the keyboard. I know like if I had a controller, maybe it'd be a little better, but this is actually, this is actually bloody hard. Yes. We got one. Well, one victory in this round that is. Oh God. <clears throat> okay. All right. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, no, no, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Oh crap. Ah. I have this habit, especially with Street Fighter. I, I like to jump a lot. And of course, that's not gonna help when I'm playing somebody like Guile. It's just, it's just a bad habit. Oh no. This might be a close shave. Oh no. Oh my god. Okay, you know what people? I'll end it there. I know it's horrible. But we'll, we'll end it there. One win. And uh, the second try at it wasn't, uh, wasn't any better. But uh, it is what it is. Uh, I'll finish off by saying thank you, big big thank you to everybody that took part, uh, it's always appreciated, remember life is like a game, you decide how to play, all you gotta do is just hit the start button, uh, always remain retro, uh, next challenge will be uh, after March the 10th, and it will be coming to us from the great nation of Ireland by a legend by the name of PG Venom. So do look out for that. Uh, that's it for me. I'm not even going to bother. But I did have fun. It was definitely frustrating. And I do appreciate everyone uh, who took part. Thank you.